Attention all proud warriors! Have you ever considered joining Time Patrol? As a Time Patroller, you'll prevent history from being changed. Our duty is to protect everyone's memories and help return history to the way it should be. But we need your help. The only requirements are confidence in your capabilities and, of course, a strong desire to protect history. We've got a school for honing your skills and a fully equipped item shop. How about it? Why not use your strength to help out a great cause? <clears throat> We're always on the lookout for powerful warriors. Okay then, listen carefully. To maintain safety here, in Kanton City, home to the Time Patrol, there are a few rules you must keep. First, firing a Kamehameha within city limits is prohibited. Time patrollers wishing to fly when not on duty are required to obtain a flying license. Please help keep Canton City safe by obeying its traffic laws. Lastly, any alteration of history is a grave offense. Our missions come with the risk of changing history. So you must exercise the utmost caution. Avoid making changes to history like Trunks did. Keeping these things in mind, please carry out your missions safely. For the sake of the world and its history, <coughs> we, we look forward to welcoming, welcoming each of you to the, the Time, Time Patrol. Patrol. Well, that was quite an intro. Alright then. Let's see what character creation is like. Oh, that's right. I need to choose <laughs> someone for that special mission. Mm-hmm. Who should I choose? Think I have time. So, 
the legendary Super Saiyan has shown up. How very unsavory. Allow me to continue my vengeance. This much the graphics look pretty nice. This will change everything. I'll show you something. Too. Oh, yeah, I got a scouter. Oh, nice. Vegeta. Vegeta! What? I finished that training armor you asked me for. <laughs> I found some wonderful material, so it should fit you like a glove compared to the old stuff. That's right, I made some state-of-the-art armor for my hard-working husband who doesn't even have a real job. I'm such a caring wife, aren't I? That is not the, uh, the gesture you should be using with a, with oh, some, come on. With a statement like that. Ugh, every day it's training, training, training. Are all Saiyans like this? For goodness sake. Ah, you really know how to tick me off. Maybe I should just throw a huge birthday party. Not that it's anyone's birthday. Yeah, it's like, what? One incoming report. Upon assessment of the situation, I have concluded that... Just wait one minute. No, oh, fuck what, off. What, what was that for? You've been specifically chosen for that critical mission. <laughs> now go out there and do it. Yeah. Oh, lovely. So why was I spying on Vegeta? Are they ever going to explain that? <laughs> Because I'm pretty sure he would have kicked my ass anyway. Not like I haven't kicked his ass before. <laughs> but that was a different game. And I'm assuming a very different timeline. Shenron just in the air. It's like, do Dragon Balls not matter? Then again, I guess this is a separate realm, so who knows how the hell the physics work. Also, Shenron is huge. You 
were very pink. That bird looks like a grandfather. Tell me I didn't just skip that. I think I just skipped it. Whoops. I might have actually skipped ahead of it by pressing options. Okay. Whew. Okay. should help. Yeah, so, but oh well. You shun! Ha! Huh. Hey there! Hello. <coughs> okay, so. at that thing. He's huge. I don't remember him being like he was I know he was big, but like Christ. He takes like an entire like holy Hi. crap. This is literally just driving me in circles. Oh well. So if you're wondering why my character is a girl, that is literally a reference to the only Dragon Ball OC I made a long time ago. Now, I didn't actually get into Dragon Ball until I was in college, and a couple of my friends were, like, really into it, and they convinced me to watch it. So I kind of, like, binged it over a couple of months. It's actually not that bad of an anime for one of the classics. Oh, great. Here we go. Like, I know who Elder Kai is, at least. No, oh, screw you. Okay.
know it's ironic that I'm playing this game in this game as a person who fixes history when I cannot stand time travel for the life of me. How does a tiny thing like you know how to fight? I thought Kai's don't fight. <laughs> Whatever, just show me. May as well do the tutorial. Okay. 
smile.
Right, left and left, spin and turn and a great big smile. That, that is such a stupid move. That's awesome! <laughs> well, I'm convinced. Glad I can put the patrol in capable hands. And that's about it for me. Come on, I'm looking forward to seeing what you can do. Hmm. saying that shit but supposed to go. But don't worry, I can handle this, probably. Oh, come on. Ow. Hello. Do I have a... I wonder, do I have a tail? I can't tell, because it looks like that's just the end of the armor. Defeat Raditz. No matter how much trash there is, it's still trash! Can I get your help? That's a lot coming from you. you. Can you even hear us? Loud and clear. We can Hey, you dropped me off in the middle of the sky. I mean, we're just whooping Raditz right now, so. Far stronger my ass. I'm kicking. I'm kicking his right now. Where the entire world bows to me. <laughs> I only have one more of those left in me. It needs to count, so you have to hold it still. And you. Well. Keeping 
your ass. Piccolo! Do it! Special beam cannon! I mean, this is still technically a slightly different timeline, Damn. considering... Damn it! And Raditz was able to dodge the first one. But I guess, considering everything else plays out the mo exactly the same, it doesn't matter. Serves you right. And I'm gone. I'm right here. How are you not noticed? That was some handy work. Those moves weren't half bad. <laughs> Not half bad. I can't. <laughs> Except for your entrance. You dropped me in the middle of the sky. Goku and Piccolo would surely have been defeated if you hadn't stepped in and saved them. It's Raditz. Jesus Christ. Your job is helping to correct any inconsistencies like this that crop up in the timeline. Yes, and I'm probably going to be the only one in typical RPG fashion. This time went smoothly, but battles later on in history get intense. Smoothly? That went flawlessly. Everyone was busy talking and I was just wailing on him like common sense would dictate. So continue with your training, because only the strong can correct history. You sure about that? But since you're training under the greatest Kai in the universe... Debatable. There shouldn't be much to worry about. <laughs> oh, that is debatable. As long as you listen to my advice, you'll come into your own eventually. And... You wasted so much time in the Majin Buu arc. Shut up. Yeah, we get it. You really do ramble, old man. Listen here, Supreme Kai of Time. Yes, I'm pretty sure that makes her outrank you. I'm only about a millennium older than you. That hardly makes me an old man. Uh-huh. What are you saying? Anyone who laid eyes on you would easily call you an old man. Yep. Don't even try to compare yourself to what an adorable that? girl like me. What is that gesture? It is not syncing up with the... With the words being spoken. You call yourself adorable? How do you find a hat with a head that big? Why am I here listening yeah, to this shit? That's all from us for the moment. We'll tell you more about the world later on. <laughs> okay then. You've got to be bored half to death after listening to his speeches. Am I right? Allow me to walk you out. This way, please. Hey, wait! You can't just jump ahead like that! Why not? <sighs> oh, brother.
Toki Toki City. That is a stupid name. use this one. Because <laughs> I never played the first one, so I can't actually make a hero of my own here. That is a girl, you idiot. Well, first off... I want to get see if I can get out of this Saiyan armor because screw that. Welcome. Jeez, this shit is expensive. Welcome, friend. Oh, 
Welcome, friend. Welcome. Okay, but yeah, I think that'll be it for episode one. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, all that shit, and I will see you in the next one. Uh, yeah.